This video will show you different ways to use the memory features of the new ClassWiz series of scientific calculators. You'll find the key steps on the screen and I will demonstrate this live. You can use memory to store answers which you want to use later. The calculator calls these memory stores variables. For example, suppose your calculation is 2.3 times 1.5. Store this answer in memory by using variable. There are six memories labeled A to F and three labeled X, Y and Z. They can all be used. Choose letter D, for example, by highlighting it and pressing OK. You want to store the answer, so choose store by pressing OK. Now enter another calculation, 5.8 divided by 0 0.9. Store this in memory A in the same way. Press variable and press OK because A is already highlighted. Choose store as before with OK. Now you can use these memories. For example, you could add the two results. There are two ways to recall a memory. The first way is to recall memory A by pressing variable and then OK because A is already highlighted. This time choose recall by scrolling down one row and pressing OK. Now add D. Press add then instead of using variable enter D directly from the keypad by pressing shift and 1. Press the execute key to complete the calculation. The answer is 1781 over 180. If you want this as a decimal, press format and choose decimal. You can also enter values directly into a memory. The easiest way is to press variable and highlight the memory letter, for example, B. Now enter your value. I'm going to use the square root of 2 and press either OK or the Execute key. Notice that the value is shown in the variable on the screen. Press the Back key to return to the app. This memory can now be used in a calculation. Using memory is a safe, accurate and effective way to store values and answers for use in other calculations. I suggest that you practice using it.